We're back. This one, I'm not going to go solids or stripes. This one, I'm just going to shoot balls. Because you don't always have to just go the routine way. This one, I'm just going to shoot whatever. And to start it out, I'm going to try a 1 9 combo. Nice easy stroke, didn't make it, let's try it again, 1-9 combo. Nice and light, you don't have to crank on the balls, you definitely don't have to crank on the balls. So now I'm going to try, 14 looks good, but a 3 ball looks pretty good too, however, we go for the 14, probably end up somewhere around here, which gives me a lot of options. And it's a much easier shot, so we'll just go with that. And now I have options. I could go 3, I could go 7, I could go, well, probably not the 2. I could go the 5, I could go the 8, I could go the 1. Lots of, lots of options. So I'm just going to go with the three ball here, and I completely screwed that one up. That's all right. I poked it instead of stroked it. <laughs> it happens. It happens. I think I tried rushing that one a little bit too much, and it is what it is, man. It is what it is. However, you just got to you just got to shoot, and that doesn't feel right. That does not feel right. I was looking at the seven ball there. Now I could go for the five. I could go for that five and give it a little bit of draw and then do the seven. That might be a good plan. And it's good to just kind of take a break. Where if I went for the seven ball, probably kick off of there. Either, either shot is good. Either shot is good. However, I think the seven ball makes a little bit more sense. One, it's close to the pocket. Two, it gives me a lot more opportunities and a lot more choices on what I want. And again, we're not shooting solids or stripes solidly. We're just we're just shooting whatever. The reason I shoot whatever is because it just for me it's the way that I practice. Everybody has their own way of practicing, and for me, the, oh, and I follow. I just follow. <laughs> How about that? Isn't that lovely? So I follow. And now I'm just going to look at the table. I could do that probably the 12, because then I have an opportunity to knock out that 13. Or I could go bing there, bing there, bing here. If I went stripes, I could go 12 all the way up top, 11, but that's stretching it. That's stretching it. The idea is to make it easier for yourself. Make it easy. Make it easy. So I'm just going to go with the two ball here. And we'll see what happens. I'm going to use some top. And hopefully the cue ball won't fall out in the pocket. Should give me some shape on the five ball. Which then could lean out to the three ball to the one ball. I could just make the eight ball right now. Why not make the eight ball right now? That's probably the easiest shot in the whole table is the eight ball. And now I have options. 
I could do the 1, I could do the 5, I think I'm just going to go with the 1. And with any luck, I'll break out that, that mess right there. Just using some straight top. Boom. Knocked it out. Got the 11 ball here. Because I hooked myself a little bit on that 6 ball there. But, considering I have the 11 ball here, which is pretty good. Kick off the side a little bit there. If I can stop that five ball, or stop the cue ball after the five, that'll line me up. It wasn't exactly a stop, a little bit of a foul, or not a foul, but a little bit of a foul low. And now if I hit the bottom lightly, Oh, <laughs> perfect position on the three ball there, but didn't have that, didn't hit that ten ball enough. So from here, I'm just going for the three ball. I'm gonna throw some draw on it and see what happens. Broke those two out, which is good. You don't have to go after the simple, simple shot right off the bat. Six ball is good. Twelve ball. Line it up. Hit it nice and softly. And from this position, I could do a combo there. Or, I could just go for the ten which could bring the cue ball over this way. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna hit it center. Nice and easy. Don't you dare scratch. Ugh. Well, that was ugly. That's all right. It happens. I'll just do the four ball first. A little bit of draw, 13 ball. Boom. Done. There we go. I hope you guys are enjoying yourselves watching me shoot some stick. Um, let me know if there's specific shots that you guys would like to see. And yeah, give it a like, give it a subscribe. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.